गुड आफ्टरनून एवरी वन दिस इज डॉक्टर श्रीनिवास देशमुख कंसल्टेंट न्यूरोलॉजिस्ट फ्रॉम द डेकन हॉस्पिटल सोमाजी गुडा हैदराबाद टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक टू यू इन दिस वीडियो रिगार्डिंग द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ एपिलेप्सी एपिलेप्सी एज यू ऑल नो इट्स अ कॉमन न्यूरोलॉजिकल डिजीज एंड द ट्रीटमेंट वेन वी लुक एट द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ एपिलेप्सी इट इज बेस्ड ऑन द फार्मोकोलॉजिकल थेरेपी एंड इन सर्टन सिचुएशन वी हैव द एपिलेप्सी सर्जरी सो इन फार्मोकोथेरेपी we have the different medicines which are used for treating epilepsy remember that the treatment of epilepsy is based on the epilepsy syndrome diagnosis so whenever the patient comes to us for the treatment of epilepsy it's important for us to try and make a diagnosis of the epilepsy syndrome in which that patient's condition is fitting so if based on the different epilepsy syndromes different treatment options are available so certain drugs are more preferable for partial onset or focal onset epilepsies and certain drugs are more preferable for generalized onset epilepsies so that is one thing to be remembered another important point to understand is that we need to make use of higher investigations in certain situations like drug resistant epilepsy so in drug resistant epilepsy if the patient has used drugs uh, multiple drugs but still continues to have epilepsy or continues to have seizures in those situations we need higher investigations like the spect and the pet scan which help us to make the diagnosis of uh, epilepsy in that particular patient and if that patient fits into a drug resistant epilepsy category then we can we have to decide whether this patient will benefit from other advanced uh, treatment modalities like the epilepsy surgery so that brings us to the concept of epilepsy surgery this is one form of treatment in epilepsy which applies to around 15 to 20% of the patients and most of the patients that is about 2/3 of the patients respond well to the medical therapy itself that means they respond well to the drugs itself only in about 15% of the 20% of the patients we have to use the epilepsy surgery where we have some particular focal lesions in the brain which can be treated with the appropriate surgeries so that is regarding the treatment of so epilepsy which includes both medical therapy and surgical therapy also in certain cases we treat the patients other comorbid issues like depression psychosis which may be there with uh, uh, epilepsy and that is treated with behavioral therapy and pharmacotherapy so thank you for your patient listening thank you so much